Welcome back to my channel. You may have heard Dubai is opening, so today I'm opening my roof to take you on a tour and explain the rules and regulations of coming to Dubai. Shall we? Well, let's get to business. The first thing you need to do is to get yourself a visa. Unless your country is entitled to visa on arrival, you need to process one. And I'd recommend that you do this through the airline, your travel agency, or even your hotel, because that's much simpler that way. Number two, you will need to have a travel medical insurance. Again, it's very simple to buy while you're in the process of booking your ticket or with your travel agency. And it could also be that your own travel insurance has international coverage. And in that case, you don't need to purchase one. So it's always good to check that policy. Number three, you will need to take a PCR test. That stands for polymerized chain reaction. It's a test that checks the genetic information of the virus, the RNA, that only manifests if you're actually carrying the virus. So it's considered a very effective test. Yes, that's that test that they put something up your nose and they test the nasal uh, samples inside. You can also choose to take this test upon arrival in Dubai. And in any case, for some reason, either your test at home is found to be invalid or if you're still showing symptoms on arrival, you will be required to take that test in Dubai anyways. It is very important for you to keep in mind, however, that the airlines are empowered and have the right to deny you boarding if you're showing any flu-like symptoms. So be prepared and don't freak out if you're having a flu. Number four, you will need to sign two declarations. One, that you're actually symptom-free. And secondly, that you take responsibility for bearing all costs if by any case you need to be quarantined in Dubai. Number five, all passengers must have the temperature checked upon arrival in Dubai. And again, if your temperature is high for any reason, you will be required to test again. And friend, if you did all these tests and you went through all these procedures, you will probably arrive in Dubai safe and sound. Which takes us to step number six. Before you leave the terminal building, you must download the COVID-19 DXB app. This app can be found in all of the app stores and it's free. Number seven, when you're out and about in Dubai, you will be required to respect the new rules and regulations. All places in Dubai require you to wear a mask publicly and also respect rules of social distancing. Of course, you would want to abide to that. And finally, number eight. In the case that any time during your trip you are found to test positive for COVID-19, you will be required to quarantine. Remember, you signed a declaration form that you take responsibility for bearing all costs associated to your quarantine and your treatment. But that's probably not going to happen. Well, enough rules and regulations because we need to have some fun here. I have a city to show to you. Shall we? Open. Crazy for love. 
the mare bitch? Yeah, it's open too. Have you been to the Dubai Canal? Well, guess what? It's open. need to tell you because by now you know it yes it's open to you and how about a frame for a selfie For the end of this ride today, I think that we saved the best for last because this is my new favorite spot in Dubai. What is yours? Comment below, give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and let's fly sometime soon.